Ashley and I are back on the property and we get to finish with Greg's help that today hopefully today <laughs> <laughs> the dogs are cooped up in the car. <laughs> they can come out now. Okay, now we've just got to finish the shelter shed and get the goat pen up for Oki and Jovi. That has to go up. Yes. This morning, which is our last day before I head home, we're moving Ashley's caravan to line it up. Oh, well, not line it up, just to move it at the moment so Greg is able to get the rest of the roofing up on the shelter shed. So we've moved everything. Everything's down. It's going to be so roomy under here. I'm going to come over this way. So anyway, we're just going to move it just so it's easier for Greg to do the roofing. And then we'll, when we come back next weekend, which is Easter weekend, um, we'll be able to align it in its um, final spot soon. Okay, so another temporary measure just until we get the shelter shed all done. Sarge and Skylar reacquainting with the goats all over again. Only one. is not sure. <laughs> Good boy, Sarge. He's gonna inspect inspect around the place. Yep, there he goes. Oh he's going back. Much better set up having 
Mr. Oak separate, which he will hopefully by the Easter weekend, this weekend is over, he'll be in here and he'll have his own little castle there. But, hey, Jovi. And then Miss Sarah, she only has less than two weeks to go. Before she has, oh, thank you, darling. Um, before she has her bubbles. Greg completed the um, shelter shed over the caravan. However, there are leaks. Um, yeah, so we're trying to work out why there are leaks. But anyway, that's the shelter shed done. Um, not all of it leaks, but probably half of it. <clears throat> so we'll be looking into that as well. So, yeah. Hey? In there? How'd she get in? Did you let her in? Yeah. Oh. Nala, no. Gentle. Gentle. You want to play. She wants to play. Well, I don't think Sarah's in a playing mood. And if you want to come to me, you have to come around. Hey, baby. You're back with your friends. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> All right, let's go out. Come on. She's doing a good job. Coming together. You're gonna have a castle, Oak. You're gonna have a castle. Yes. Hello. Hello, Oaky. Hello. Hello. Mr. Liquor. Mr. Liquor. Mr. Liquor. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> crazy boy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Yes, 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 yes. And up it goes. Oh. I can't watch this. I gotta walk away. It makes me nervous. <laughs> okay, I'm walking away. Mammoth effort. We've got the goat castle up. It's not quite finished yet. But um quite happy with it. Looks really good. I think Oki is going to love his little castle <laughs> it's so cool ashley's up on it already that's not the ramp that we're actually going to use but i think for now for ashley to at least get down off of it Yeah, you almost got Sarge. Sorry, Sarge. <laughs> almost. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. So there you go. So I think for temporary measures at the moment, because we're running out a bit of puff, um, we're just going to use this shelter um, and pop underneath. Um, it's going to be hard to get in and clean, but maybe if we put it up on some bricks or something and we're actually putting it under there. So, um, so at least he can be protected at night. It's going to be a bit airy for him, but might have to put some sheet of iron at the back so it's not so airy. And then um, because it's not that huge under here, playing plain away clamp just have to get a clamp for hubby it's putting the temporary fence back up so mr oki doesn't get out but there you go see those clouds it's gonna rain again yep hey my goodness too much energy with these dogs oh Look at Sarge! Look at Sarge! Hi, 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 Sar
Oh my gosh! Oh, that's hilarious. I think he's stuck. <laughs> they want to get up. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> now they all want to get up. Oh my goodness. Go on, Nala. Oh, Nala doesn't want to miss out. <laughs> That kitchen can be ripped out. Yeah, I need to it. And like all all the extras in there can be ripped out except the bell. The bell can stay. No, oh, it went. <laughs> Where's it the bell? It's broken. Oh, okay. No, don't, no jumping. Uh, 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 uh. Sorry, G. Don't think about no it. No jumping. Nala. I don't know if they'll. No, oh, <laughs> come on, Nala. Oh, good girl. You did it. You did it. While well, Greg is finishing off waterproofing um, Oki's goat pen, ravioli, baby. What are you doing, Skylar? You saying hello to Oki? You saying hello to Oki? It's coming along. All right. It's ding ding times. Oh, I should show you. I made the steps better. It was so narrow just over here, but I've made it wider and it looks so much better. Just got to plant those trees there. I'm happy with that. Awesome. Oh, look at those clouds. I think it's going to rain again. Well, it's the morning after Greg and Ashley have left to go back to suburbia. And I'm, again, on my own with Nala and the animals. <sighs> yeah. I've got to keep myself busy because otherwise I start thinking too much and I start getting down because I'm on my own. But once I get busy, once I get sorted, once I start sorting out things that we've brought down here onto the homestead, I just get busy and the day goes by and, you know, I plot on. I just plot on. But I want to show you the end result of what Greg's hard work has done. And that is fixing up Oki's pen. This morning when I let him out of the pen with uh, Sarah and Jovi, I shoved him straight into his own pen. So I think he's in a little bit of shock at the moment um, because he's in his own pen. Um, where is he? Oh, he's down in the corner. <laughs> he's down there. But from here, I'll show you. So I, I fed him this morning in his own pen so he knows where to, to eat. I'm not sure if you can see because there's a sunlight. It's glaring this way. But um, I'll take you down there and I'll show you because I'm also going to give him a distraction, something fun to play with. A hay ball. So that should keep him occupied for a little bit. And I've got some yummy apples that we collected on the side of the road on the way to the property. Um, yeah, there's an abundance of apple trees. So I'm, let me face this way. Oh no, that's worse. Oh, that's glary. Sorry, I don't mean to spin you around. Um, 
yeah, there's an abundance of apple trees on the side of the road. Actually, not just apple trees. We came across peach trees. We saw a pear tree and we saw a lemon tree, but uh, we couldn't pull over. Um, there was cars behind us. So we know roughly where they are. So we'll go back and collect some. Anyway, I'm going to go tie this up, give this to Oki, um, keep him happy. Her udder has dropped significantly. I can't really feel the ligaments in the back, in her back area. And this is going to be rather difficult for me to open the door, get in there and video. So I'm going to have to shut this down. Here is Oki's pen. And I think that's a good spot to put the hay ball. Even though like having the hay feeder here for him is just temporary because we've had to put this shelter in here um, just because Greg did a quick job. But then he ended up doing a great job of um, putting all the iron on. So I'm super stoked with that. That's going to protect him from the weather. And it's around the back as well. Um, I'm not sure if I can, I can't see because of the sun, but anyway, he's covered it at the back as well here, which is really good. So this is his castle. <laughs> oh my goodness, for a goat, that was super, super heavy. There you go, Mr. Oak. And I'll give you some apple. I've got some apple for you, buddy. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. All right, come and get some apple. Come and get some apple. Yeah, so he wouldn't grab it from me. Here, Oak. Oak. Oh, you like that. You like that. Yeah. My first priority was to create a safe haven for him. This is two areas, safe haven for him. They've both got shelter. They've both got access to the pasture, which we will make bigger. Um, just not right now because I'm still dealing with everything. But this is enough. They've got enough room from like here, way right on the outside. So yeah, I'm, I'm stoked. I'm happy with that. Yay to Greg and Ashley for all their efforts. And um, all right, I'm gonna go and give Sarah and Jovi you're loving that boy, aren't you? You're loving that. You're loving that. You have that. Yeah. You have that. Oh, you like your face rubbed. You like your face rubs. Oh, you like that. You like that. There you are. All right. I'm going to go and see Mr. Jovi and Sarah. And he did this gate. He actually did a great job of that so and it opens on the other side because he likes to push it open and yet we can push him away and then come Woo! Ha -ha. <laughs> there you go whoops let's take that come on sarah i got some yummies for you here here sarah oh there you go jovi you help yourself you help yourself There you go. You helping yourself, Jovi? You helping yourself? Get another one for Sarah? Yeah, all right, Sarah, here. Here. There. Mr. Oak, you king of the castle there. You king of the castle. Oops, there goes that. All right, so there you go. Mr. Oaky's castle. I'm glad Greg strengthened these pallets up. Yes, darling. <laughs> you say hello? You say hello? <laughs> All right, that's it, folks. That's his castle. And that's my next project. That's the milking area. I need to do that and get that sorted for Miss Sarah. I won't be milking her straight away, but once the kids are a little bit older, um, 
I'm not too sure when I can start milking her because I don't want to take the nutrients away from the babies. Um, maybe three weeks, four weeks. I, I don't know. I have to check. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely want to start milking and um, yeah, have our own milk, which I'll be stoked about. But that needs to be blocked off. There will be a gate on that area. So she can't go in. Um, well, nobody can go in. Um, all the necessary equipment things that I will need will be there, except for the um, the milking. In, um, I made my own. <laughs> what are you doing, JV? There's nothing in there, boy. There's nothing. I decided to let the chook chooks out of their pen so they can eat the grubs in here. Nala doesn't really care. I did warn her. I said, leave the chook chooks. And she's just gone back to being a sun pig. She's happy. She's in the sun. I'm going to do some work in um, the kitchen area in there. Um, just unpacking some stuff just while I'm out here. So I'll keep an eye on the girls. Might let them out for the day. I'll just see how they go. Um, as long as they leave the plants alone, the geraniums, the lavenders, they can stay out. Mm -hmm.